guys, it's Rock the Gold, and welcome back to Far Cry 4. If you remember from the last episode, we made our escape from the very charismatic Pagan. And honestly, I kind of wish I had stayed with him. He seems like one of those guys where if uh, he just did what he said and made him happy, that he'd make you happy, you know. Get along mutually. But yeah, no. Instead, we decided to escape. Uh, got run off the road, and now my driver's dead, head smushed in by a tree. So I've got whatever's left from that gun that I took from the dashboard, plus now a knife. And um, I'm learning the stealth fundamentals. The detection meter fills up as enemies spot you. If it is full and flashes, you're detected. Press T to throw a rock and distract enemies, okay? Press C to crouch. You will be less visible and make less noise when walking. All right. Well, we've already got some guys coming up after me, so... Let's throw a rock, see what happens. This has all been just a terrible misunderstanding. Show yourself and we'll sort it all out. What is that place? Nice, okay. So, we now know the basics of stealth. Bullshit, I don't have to hide. Oh yeah, let's uh make things easier on yourself. Let's go from kind words to just blatant threats. Uh it's really the way to coax me out of hiding. Let's see if I can throw that. Take this guy down. I actually do takedowns from pretty far away in this game, it seems. Bitch. Alright. So, what do I have for gun? I only have this now. Where's my knife? Okay. I, will find you. I feel like I did a bad thing by picking up this gun. He's going to escape. No, he's not. Don't you worry. He can't have gotten far. Oh, the joke, he got away. Emma? Yay. Ubisoft loves making condom. Yay. Is that actually going to be necessary? All right. Damn it, I got to stop throwing rocks instead of pressing reload. Swim on water to hide from enemies and become undetected. Why would I do that? All right. There's a flag. Is it like a checkpoint or something? Or I don't hear a scene. If I guess I'm gonna risk a little bit of speed here. Hello. To get bait, hold E to skin. Open the weapon wheel by hold. Oh, okay. Huh. So, weapon wheel. Throwing knives, done. Still don't have my actual knife anymore, but alright. And yet, there it is. I suppose I should have actually, you know, read the instructions on how to play this game, but I never do that. Come on. Where are you hiding? I'm trying to throw the bait. Hold on. Uh, uh bait, okay. Keep 
Is it a bear? Here, yes, bear. Headshot. Headshot. Yes, bear. You go ahead and eat your meal. Just stay away from me now. Um. Crap, am I gonna have to kill this bear? Is there a path up here I can. No, of course not. I really don't want to have to kill a bear. Oh, uh, God. It's okay. Just uh, keep eating your man flesh. Don't mind me. Just passing through. Gotta check this guy real quick. Stay there, please. Sounding a little, uh, a little aggressive, but no, he's fine. Okay, cool. Let's risk a little more speed. Uh huh, okay. Now, got some guys up ahead. Looks like. Ah, uh, what do we give for a sniper rifle right about now? Can't tell if they're hostile or not. Now, what is this? Body armor? How do I get to you? Huh. Oh, can I... Climb up into... Okay, I got nothing. I have no idea what to do. What, was that a, I saw a flash or something? Yes. Will you? Okay, let's pick you up. No idea what you are. Uh, how can I get into you? There's a chest and there's body armor. All right. Press Z to equip or holster your camera, aim and zoom at enemies and animals. Camera will tag them and track their positions. Okay. Anyone else? Okay. Let's see if I can pull this off. Come on, a little higher. Nope. I love how it somehow gives me vision of them behind objects. This is like pointing my camera at them. Uh, someday. Someday I'll have a sniper rifle again. Sorry. sorry, not sorry. Hey, buddy. Pretty kitty. Wait, Clyde, what button is that? I'm being dead serious. I don't know what button that is. Who's your pretty kitty? Who's your pretty kitty? Oh. Oh, it's the space bar. Okay. Oh. So now that they taught me that here and not back where I actually could have used it. No, by all means. Let's teach you how to climb up and into the cage with the gigantic cat, but not the helpful body armor. Oh. Oh. Because apparently I can't climb this cage. Uh, Alright. That was a waste. Uh, 
I feel like the humane thing to do would actually be to put this cat out of its misery. Because unfortunately, I've killed its captors. Which means that if I were to leave it here, that it would just die from starvation. Oh, what to do? I'd also be wasting ammo. But, uh, if I can't set it free, I, I gotta. Oh, I could set it free. And now, well, I put you down in the most humane way possible. And now I know for future reference that I can shoot the gates and unleash you upon my enemies. Your death will not have been in vain, pretty kitty. I salute you. And I thank you for your, your noble, unoffered sacrifice. And we press on. All right. Let's see. Still 350 meters off. Let's see if we can close that gap a little bit. RJ, my boy, are you busy? You don't mind me calling, do you? Fantastic. You really are an excellent listener. Look, no hard feelings about the crab rangoon. I know it's not to everyone's taste. But you'll be pleased to know I had the chef executed for his incompetence. Or was it his family we killed? <laughs> wow. Next time I can promise you a better spread. That's the last time I'm kidnapping a fucking TV celebrity chef. Well, he still wants to be my friend, it seems. I would shoot those guys to take their hearts, but there's a. Uh, you know what? Fuck, they're right here. Well, I wasn't gonna do it. But I done did it. He came running at me. I uh, I felt uh, threatened. Yeah, I felt threatened. That's it. Those goats. Those deadly goats. Alright, I'm coming up on the tower at least. And leap. Excellent. Uh -huh. I'm reaching the bell tower objectives. God. Oh, hello. Cool. All right. Can I climb? Oh, thank you. I can climb. All right. Different. That's kind of cool, though. Honor to meet you, son of Mohan. I'm amazed you made it all the way here on your own. Thanks, I think. Is waiting for you near the tower. Uh, well, uh, I can't take any of your alcohol. Fine. All right. Well, I got people waiting for me at the tower. Apparently, in a safe area. No risk. No reason to try to be stealthy now. Let's see what we got going on here. I wonder if that... I'm, I'm experiencing some blinking, like it blacks out for a quick second. Like, a split second. Like, very quickly. Um, I don't know if that's happening on the capture or not, either. Hey, look, it's, uh, Pig and Min. Is it? It looks like it. Huh. I don't know. I guess we're gonna find out. Hello? Hi. Okay, you made it. Good job, son of Mohan. Why are you guys helping me? Don't you know, mind me. Mohan Just, uh... You may not know it, but that name carries a lot of weight in the Sniper rifles, yeah. Especially for the Golden Bar. Are those army guys still looking for me? Pagan men will stop at nothing to get you back. Damn. Some of Pagan's men managed to track us. They'll be here any second. We're in for a fight. Alright, give me uh give me a sniper rifle. And we'll be good to go. Alright, I have like every kind of ammo known to man, I just don't have the weapons. That's two. I'm taking cover. Oh, 
Okay, grenades is in the middle. No, no. Uh, where's this last guy? There he is. Well, that was stupid. Whoa. Oh, wait, that wasn't a grenade I threw, that was base. So, grenades. Grenades, there we go. Oh, I call a snow leopard. That bait trick works really well, apparently. Tell me twice. Woo! Am I glad I went up to the upper floor? Oh, that uh, apparently went a little worse than I thought. Where that? Wait, where the hell am I? You're a tough man to kill, brother. That's a good thing, right? <laughs> Yay! We finished the prologue! Awesome! It didn't take nearly as long as it did with Assassin's Creed Unity. We were into episode 5 by the time we got to that title card. Although we technically haven't gotten to this title card either yet, we have at least finished the prologue, so that's pretty awesome. But yeah. Alright, so, that being the case, this, uh, never mind, because we have a cutscene now. How did you know to find me? He saw Bacon's chopper nearby. He's never down this far south, and I wanted to know why. Lucky for you, we were in the area when we got Darpan's text. here. Welcome to Banapur, home of the Golden Path. Who's this? Where's Darpan? Oh, you're the sassy love interest, are you? This is Ajay Gale, Mohan's son. Let me understand. Darpan's dead. Hmm? And you brought me this. I'm not involved in, in whatever this is. I'm just... Looking for Lakshmana. We're in the middle of a fucking war. We don't have time for tourists. Yep, sassy love interest. What was I supposed to do? Just leave him there? I'm sorry, brother. Amita's a little touchy. I'll talk to her. As for Lakshmana, it sounds like it could be a temple or shrine. But if that's the case, it's in the north. The north is enemy territory, and we can't get you there, not yet. Go and clear your head. Just give me a sniper rifle with a silencer on it. And I'll end this war for you. Well, I gotta say, this game, like Assassin's Creed, is very pretty. And doesn't seem to have nearly the amount of graphical issues that Unity did. But yes... Now that we're here and we're in a comfortable resting place, open the crafting menu, we'll check that out next time. Uh, it's a good place to end the episode right here. So, we'll see what happens next time now that we're finally in a quiet place where we can kind of settle down and take things slow. And, yeah, we'll see what we can figure out with that whole crafting menu thing as well. Alright guys, I will see you guys on the other side. Take care.